there are a lot of things running on your phone that you're not even aware of. Features that constantly pull your personal data and may even share your phone number with untrusted sources, hackers, or advertisers who will keep spamming you with ads all day long. Today, I'm going to explain how this happens, why it happens, and how to stop it with very simple steps. All supported by official sources and evidence from Google itself, so you can see for yourself and believe it. How is your phone number getting leaked without your knowledge? First, Caller ID and Spam Protection. There's a feature called Caller ID and Spam Protection inside the Google Phone app, which comes pre-installed on many Android phones. It claims to protect you from spam calls and scammers. But here's what they don't clearly tell you. For this feature to work, Google sends your phone number and call data to its servers to analyze and determine whether the call is spam or not. Official proof from Google. On Google's own support page, they clearly state that your call information, including the numbers you receive and the numbers you dial, are sent to their servers for analysis. The fix. Open the phone app. Tap the three dots in the top right corner. Go to Settings, Caller ID and Spam. Turn off Caller ID and Spam. Second, Ad Personalization. Google has a massive advertising system that collects a huge amount of data about you, including your phone number, contacts, locations, interests, and even your app usage times. This feature is called Ad Personalization. It allows companies to target you with ads based on your number or any other data Google has collected about you. Official proof. When you access the Google ad settings, you'll see that Google already knows your interest device type birth date location. And all of this is linked to your account. The fix. Open any browser and go to your Google account. Click manage your Google account. Go to the tab, Data and Privacy. Scroll down to Add Personalization. Click My Ad Center. Turn it off. Third, Suspicious Permissions from Harmless Apps. Simple apps like a photo filter app. A kid's puzzle game, a ringtone customizer, might request totally unrelated permissions such as access to your contacts, reading your calls, using the camera in the background, a ringtone app asking for permission to access your full contact list. That's suspicious. How to check that? Go to this site. This website analyzes Android apps and shows what data is being shared, what permissions the app is using, whether it's accessing contacts, location, or sensitive info. The fix. Go to Settings. Privacy. Permission Manager. Choose Contacts. Review the list of apps with access. Revoke access from any app that doesn't need it. Fourth, Nearby Share. Nearby Share is supposed to help you quickly send files to nearby devices, but a past security flaw caused your device name and phone number to be visible to anyone nearby, especially if your settings aren't properly adjusted. The fix. Go to Settings. Google. Device Connections Nearby Share Set Visibility to Hidden or Contacts Only The danger of your number being leaked isn't just about privacy, it's much more serious. Scam Calls People pretending you won a prize or that there's a problem with your bank account Malicious SMS Messages Texts with infected links like Your package has arrived? Click here to track but it's a virus. Unwanted subscriptions? You find yourself registered for contests or services you never signed up for. 
Don't let anyone exploit you or your data. Take just 10 minutes to turn off the settings above review all app permissions and protect your privacy for good.